I mean, obviously, part of the reason Jacob Zuma is not yet back behind bars, should you have your way, is that this matter is still pending a final decision, and at this stage is at the SEA. Yes, so, so firstly, thank you very much. Um, yeah, the matter is going to be heard by the SEA, I believe, in August. Um, the, the underlying issue here is not that we at AFRI Forum want uh, Jacob Zuma to go to jail. The question is not should he go to jail or should he not. That's not the primary question. Keith. The primary question, as far as we are concerned, is how would an ordinary member of the public have been treated um, under the same circumstances? And, and our concern is what we are seeing at the moment with the criminal justice system is it becomes quite clear um, and evident that the former president is being treated in a particular way because of who he is. And it appears to us as if, if a, just a normal member of the public and an average South African citizen were to have been in that exact same situation, we are quite sure that that person would not have been given medical parole. The consequence of that ultimately would be that he, of course, does go back to jail. But, I mean, if you look at the Department of Correctional Services' involvement in this case, do you believe that ultimately because he was no ordinary member of the public, this was ultimately a convenient political solution. Yeah, well, I think it, um, it could be, it, it could, but that's the whole point, is that it, it appears to us that the whole matter is being approached as a political issue. And if we reach a point where releasing someone from prison um, is the, the way to go because it's a solution to a political problem, then the obvious consequence of that is that that people who are um, politically aligned, they have political power, um, are given preferential treatment. Um, and the, the end of the, the message here is that the former president is above the law. Um, and, and there's a big concern among the public, among Afro members in particular, but I would say among the public in, in general, that um, this has been an ongoing thing with politicians, but in particular for, for Jacob Zuma. Um, and, and people have lost faith in the criminal justice system <clears throat> where people are the, – the, the general message out there or the general feeling seems to be that, that there's no point in even trying anymore because we know the criminal justice system is, is, is not there to, um, to protect the average person on the street. It's there yeah. to protect politicians. 702. More than a radio station. Let's walk the talk.